present. I have nothing to lose. Nothing can stop me. I'm all the way up. Wake up. I know what's real. Escape reality. Hardwired. Welcome to Throwback Thursday, number 10. The Unicorn John Part Darts Review starts right now. Hey, what's up guys? Worldwide here. We got a great video for you today. In this video, we're gonna be taking a close up look at the Unicorn John Part World Champion Ambassador Darts. And I think that's gonna make a great video for Throwback Thursday, number 10. Can you believe we're up to 10 already? So the reason why I'm featuring these darts today is because I happened to pick them up over at Double Top Darts in the UK. They were in the clearance section. And by the way, if you check down in the pinned comment down below, there'll be a link to take you right over to the Double Top Darts clearance section. Score yourself a deal. But yeah, I paid right around 25 pounds for these things, which is, I don't know, right around 35 US dollars. However, I did use that discount code as well. Feel free to use that if you wish and I saved myself a couple extra dollars. So yeah, great deal on these darts, but I won't keep you waiting any longer. Let's grab the other, where is it? Let's grab the other camera, the new camera. We'll take a close up look over some stats and dimensions. And then after that, I'll get these things on the board. I'll throw them for a little bit and I'll give you some feedback on what I think of the Unicorn John Part darts. So should be a good video, guys. Here we go. Okay, kicking off Throwback Thursday, number 10 with the Unicorn John Part World Champion Ambassador Edition darts. Now, like I just said in the intro, I picked these up at Double Top Darts in the UK. Now, sadly, the natural tungsten version, as I have here, they're out of stock. They were so incredibly discounted, they went out of stock almost immediately. However, they do have the DNA-coded version as well as the golden titanium-coded version still available as of the uploading of this video, June 17th, 2021. But as you see here, I actually really like this display case. Unicorn put quite a bit of work into it, and if you have a close look here, these were released back in 2017. Now, John is no longer with Unicorn, and to be honest, I'm really not sure who he signed with right now, but nonetheless, what do you say we get these things opened up? We'll get them put together and go over some stats and dimensions. Okay, so before we go over the stats and dimensions, I just want to show you what's inside and what's included. So we've got this really nice case here, and it comes in this cardboard tray. But as you see there, these are 24 grams. The guaranteed weight says 24.2 grams. So I want to double check that here in just a second. But yeah, we've got this magnetic enclosure unicorn case. Of course, we have our 24 gram barrels there, aluminum stems, aluminum stems. You don't really see those included in too many new sets of darts anymore. I think the majority or the vast majority of dart companies now include nylon stems, but then we also have our world champion edition unicorn standard size flights. But yeah, let me get these things put together and we'll run down some stats and dimensions. Okay, there we go, fully assembled, stock out of the package. And you know, I don't say this too much, and maybe not to nitpick, but not the greatest looking set of darts I've ever seen in my life. I don't know if it's the metal stems combined with the kind of pinkish red flights. Just doesn't seem to go together all that well. I mean, the barrels are awesome, so it's very easy to change out the stems and flights if you wish, which I am going to do later on in the video. But uh, like I said, we've got the medium length aluminum stems. We've got the standard size Unicorn and John Park World Championship flights. But writing down the rest of the stats and dimensions, these are a 90% tungsten barrel. The barrel length coming in at 50.8 millimeters long and these not quite being a straight barrel dart they're more tapered so it starts here in the front end and gradually gets slimmer as we go to the back of the barrel the widest point 6.6 millimeters wide in the front and then you saw the weight on these things advertised as 24 grams the unicorn card said 24.2 and that was actually spot on because we have 24.26 grams 24.28 and finally, 24.29 grams. So the barrel's only three one hundredths of a gram off. Excellent match waiting there from Unicorn. But what do you say we get a little bit closer look at the John Part barrels? Okay, I hope that's a decent enough close-up look at the barrels. I guess we can start on the front end. 
As you'll see there, silver points, if you caught my last video, not a fan of those things at all, but um, I will be scuffing up the points so I won't lose any darts on the floor. And also, if you notice, quite the lip where the point meets the barrel, I will be fixing that with a set of Trident 180 nose cones. And speaking of nose cones, we got a nicely tapered nose cone there with two multi-rings. Right behind that, we have what Unicorn calls purest grip. I believe that's what that is, and it's a twin ring grip. Right behind there in the smooth section, we got the Unicorn logo with the Canadian maple leaf. Of course, John Part is from Canada. And then going further back on the rear end of the barrel, more purest grip, basically, again, twin ring grip. And then on the very back end of the barrel, we have that micro multi-ring, which I quite like. goes all the way to the stem. So there's grip all the way to the stem, which is nice. You don't see that on too many sets of darts. And you know, very smooth feel. There's no sharp edges anywhere along the barrel. But it still offers, uh, the purest grip offers quite a bit of bite, though. As a result, I'll go ahead and give these a level 3 grip on a scale of 1 to 5. But what do you say we get these things on the board? And I will not be using these stock flights. They're so difficult to replace. So back in the package, those things go. We'll keep them in mint condition. And instead, I'll use the Unicorn Maestro DXM flights. So yeah, real small. I think Phil Taylor used to use those. But yeah, we'll put those on and get these things on the board and see how they fly. So here we go. Okay, here we go. Let's have a few throws with the Unicorn John Part darts. As you see there on top, we've got the Unicorn DXM flights. And man, what a huge difference those things make compared to a standard size flight. They get to the board so, so much quicker. It's like night and day difference, but yeah, they track dead straight to the board. If you have a hard throw, it might be worth trying out smaller flights. As far as the stems though, not a huge fan of those. They're a little bit too long for me. On top of that, extremely heavy. Believe it or not, this entire setup weighs about 26.4 grams. So yeah, you know, definitely on the heavy side for sure. But nonetheless, I mean, they were throwing really nice. And hopefully that continues now that I just hit record. Oh yeah, look at that, dead center of the treble 20. Ah, good way to kick off though. Man, that first dart was just buried dead center of that treble 20. Uh, what was I gonna say? Oh, you know what, it's funny enough, I did break out the, um, I don't even know what this is, just the uh, point tool. I scuffed these points up before I hit record. I don't want any more 60s on the floor, so. These silver points will not get the best of me today. Wow, they traveled to the board so quick. Did that one go in? Cover shot. Oh, mm, get in. Nice. All right. Can we have three more good throws, please? But man, I absolutely love these barrels. A little on the heavy side for me. The grip sections, though, incredible set of barrels for a front gripper. Not so much for a middle gripper because of that smooth section, but if you're a rear gripper, man, I would highly recommend these just because that um, also has that micro multi-ring grip going all the way to the stem. So for a rear gripper, man, what a perfect set of barrels here. And that's where I'm gripping, kind of in the rear. Right, oh, loud motorcycle going by. Oh, way to back that up, huh? And for all the uh, Canadian players out there, pretty much this is going to be a last chance to get these sets of darts. I mean, you know, I guess John is no longer with Unicorn, so obviously they're going to be discontinued. It's a great set for the collection. I mean, even if you just want to put them in the case, never play with them, that's fine too. Oh, I started out so good. What happened? Oh, third dart saver. Yeah, I'm happy to pick these up for the collection. Always been a huge fan of John Part. I think just because he's from North America, obviously I'm here in the United States. So, and I think he's highly underrated as well. Probably one of the most underrated players. Dude's a straight legend. Three time world champion. Beating Phil Taylor in his prime. Oh, hey, that third one was in. I will take it. Wow. So 
Man, as you see there, they were flying really, really nice. Had the one poor turn, but other than that, four incredible turns, one really good turn, 177. So yeah, no complaining about these things. If they were mine, I would, um, I would definitely change out the stems, and that's really the only thing. I mean, yeah, you can change out the silver points. I would pretty, yeah, I mean, I definitely would change out the silver points if I was going to use them. Uh, probably put on a specialty point just to remove that lip where the point meets the barrel. That's quite, that's quite a massive lip right there. But you know, Trident 180 cones do the trick. So there you go, guys. Got the 177 for you, but let's do about three points better. So I have one more clip for you. Hope you enjoy it. Here we go. Tucked in the right hand corner. Oh, can we do a right to left? Oh, yeah, called it. Boom! Roasted. I don't even know what that means. But yeah, nice little right to left on the 180. So there we go, guys. Great place to end the video. I hope you enjoyed a close up look at the unicorn John Part World Champion Ambassador Darts again. The link will be down in the pinned comment. Take over to Double Top Darts sales section or clearance section, whatever you want to call it. Score yourself a deal. Again, the DNA still available. DNA coated John Parr darts, the golden titanium coated ones still available as well. So yeah, get yourself a deal. Feel free to leave a comment down below. And before you go, I would appreciate a thumbs up. Let me know you enjoyed the video. And until next time, guys, we will see you on the next video. Later.